Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do something a little bit different and unique. I have often been asked, you know, Kyla, what colors would you like to see for, for future rainbow highlines? Like what, what colors do you think we need? And I have been wanting to do this for a long time. And so I found this random website. And if I remember, I'll leave it linked down below where it had a ton of colors listed and I it had it listed like by category because I really wanted to, you know, go ahead and compare the colors to each other. So I'm not saying that I found this website with every color that ever exists because I don't even know if there's a website that has that. But I went ahead and I looked at all the different colors on this website and it gave me a pretty good amount. And, you know, some of them I already had in mind and things like that. But these are just colors that I would like to see in future Rainbow High dolls. I'm not really a big fan of when they do the whole dolls with the rainbow theme like they did with the um, Rockstar ones because all three of them are rainbow themed. I was more of a fan of how they did the sleepover ones where each of them had a specific color with the gold, pink, and blue. I thought that was really nice. So that's kind of what I'm leaning towards here. I tried to have like at least a few from each of the, you know, core colors and I thought this would be really fun. So obviously there's going to be way more colors out there than what I have, but these are the ones that I really liked and stood out to me the most. In no particular order, we're going to start with the purples. So this one is called English Violet. And I know we already have our main purple doll named Violet. And then we have our violet colored doll, Leela, who will be coming to us very soon. But I thought this was a really interesting shade of purple. I'm not really a purple fan. I know we have received a purple doll in just about every core series. I think, I think so. Yeah, I mean, Crystal can categorize as blue and purple. So I thought this was a really nice, unique looking shade of purple. So this is mauve, and I don't think I've ever shared this before, but the theme of my bedroom is mauve, so I have like a ton of mauve pillows, and my entire um, bedding set is mauve, so I would absolutely love if they were to do a doll with this color scheme. I think the hair, I would really be interested to see the hair in this color. This can categorize as pink and purple, but it had it in the purple category, so this is the color mulberry, and I think this is a really interesting color. I didn't want to pick too many pinks, but I'm going to warn you guys there are pinks on this list. I don't know. I just think like we've seen like the bubblegum pink, uh, hot pink, baby pink. And, you know, like I thought this was a nice pink purple color, you know, mixed in between. This is called Tyrion Purple. I believe that's what it's called. That's probably like my inner Game of Thrones coming out. If you get that reference, let me know. But anyway, I am a big fan of the darker purple dolls because like there's just something about them that looks really cool. And honestly, we only really have Emmy. So I'm a huge fan of Emmy. She is my favorite like main series purple doll. Um, with We exclude Winter Break Violet because we all know she is superior to all the Rainbow High dolls. But anyway, I love Emmy. So I think Orchid was really nice. So this kind of really reminded me of Orchid and I would love to see another darker purple doll. Now we're moving on to blue and I've only picked two, but this one is navy. So I have been saying for a while now, I would really love a navy blue doll. I would have put Cobalt on this list, but Coco is actually coming to us from Series 4. I was very excited for that. Um, I think I, I'm not super excited. She is actually my least favorite from the series. Um, that's just based on first impressions and stuff. Maybe I'll love her more once I make her my own, but I've often said I would like a navy or a cobalt doll, so now that we're getting a cobalt doll, I would really love a navy doll. So I have denim on here, but then I was thinking about it, and I'm like, well, Skylar technically has a bunch of denim in her first outfit, so I think she's just supposed to be like generic blue, so I still kept it on this list. I think it would be very nice to see a doll in denim. I think the hair, I keep saying the hair because the hair is always the first thing that stands out to me and it would be really nice to see um blue hair like this now i'm not a big fan of blue um so i prefer like the ice and the um whatever robin's color is i prefer like gabrielle and robin's colors when it comes to blue so i didn't really have a ton of blues that stood out to me and that i liked so that's why there's only two of them right now i have two yellows with apricot being the first so i don't know how they would do this I didn't, I wasn't sure about this, but then I remember Delilah is coming to us and her color is supposed to be butterscotch and I think she looks so adorable. So if they could do something along these lines, we would obviously get another doll with like kind of more realistic looking hair, but I don't think that's a bad thing because I wanted to also include like brown tones on this list, but I didn't do that as of right now. But I think like apricot, it just provides like this nice light um, feel to like 
like if this was in say series five it would just provide like a nice super bright like pastel feel to the series if that makes sense this one is more yellowy and it is marzipan and i thought this was really pretty it was kind of right next to i think they called it like banana yellow and then above it was like lemon yellow and i wanted to include those but i decided to just pick between the three and this is the one that stood out to me the most again like i don't think the original six were given like specific shades of color so i kind of like don't i don't know how close this would be to sunny but i mean it's going to get to the point where some of the colors are going to look slightly similar which is fine that doesn't bother me but out of the two yellows that i picked i think i definitely prefer the marzipan one now we're going to move on to the greens and i actually have three greens so this one is forest green and green is my least favorite color of all time i do love daphne minton though because i'm a fan of the mint color but as for like karma and jade i love karma as a doll like appearance wise but i do not like her color at all and jade is just kind of like neutral so i like the darker greens with the exception of daphne of course i'm extremely excited for jewel richie because she is our emerald doll so she's our first darker green doll and i'm really excited to see how she looks in person jade's last name may be hunter but she is definitely not hunter green so i you guys know i don't collect boy dolls but i feel like if they were to ever do this it would probably make a good color for a boy doll i mean it would be really interesting to see um girl doll wise maybe i don't know i'm not really a big fan of sporty girl dolls either you guys probably know that too but maybe this one um depending on like how it would look i could definitely see this being used for like the sporty tomboyish um girl type dolls like nicole and jade and things like that this is jungle green and i kind of just threw this one in here spontaneously because it reminded me a little bit of daphne so it's like a mix between probably like daphne and jade it, definitely more mint tone i guess you could say i don't know i definitely see this as more of a blue green but i think this is actually a really nice color and it might be my favorite of the three now that i'm looking at them all side by side i actually forgot about this one like i said so i put this one in here i think hair hair wise this one would look really really cool coral is starting off the red pink and orange families i kind of just grouped them all together so i've always said i really want a coral colored doll it's not my favorite i'm not a big fan of orange either but as you guys know red and pink are my two favorite colors and i have been saying this from the very beginning we need more red ruby has literally carried the red family way too long she does have some help from laurel but laurel is a mix of a ton of different colors so i think this would be a good if you display your dolls in rainbow order like i used to they're actually changed right now but i think it would be a good transition color um from red to orange it reminds me a lot of simone actually sun sunrise was on like this list and i was like oh that's simone's color so i thought that was really cool so this is wine red and it reminds me a lot of Merlot who is one of my custom American girls and she has a wig that part of it is this color and I named the doll after kind of the wig and everything so that's like a long story and not related to rainbow high at all but it makes me think of her i don't know if they would do this color because i mean this could be like the slightest thing but it's called wine red and this is obviously a line of dolls that is geared towards children primarily so i don't know if they would do that i don't know if that would stop them from doing that that's just me i think this would look really cool and now that we're getting burgundy i'm so excited mila is my second favorite from series four just based on first impressions so i think i'm very excited for burgundy i always said i wanted a burgundy doll so i'm really excited for her and i think like if we keep adding more reds to the family that the wine would fit in very nicely all right, so we have Maroon here. Just think about this for a minute because I know I haven't really developed any of the dolls like concept-wise in thorough detail when I thought of these colors, but think about a maroon color doll with a maroon color lip, like maroon, sparkly maroon eyeshadow. I don't know if anybody else would love this as much as I would, but I would absolutely love to see that. And of course, more red family representation. I don't even care if they do the cliche thing and name the character Scarlet. This color just needs to be used and I feel like she should probably have like Wizard of Oz ruby slippers because that would just be pure genius. I'm trying to get through these last ones really quickly because I didn't expect this to be this long, but I think raspberry would look really cool. 
I, again, with the hair, I would just be really interested to see, like, how all this hair would turn out in these different colors, and I think this is a very nice, like, it's a subtle pinkish red, I guess you could say. I love fall. It's not my favorite season, but burnt orange is definitely a fall color. No, I didn't go ahead and pick, like, a pumpkin spice, even though, like, I am that girl, but I particularly have a sweater in my own personal collection of clothing that is this color and I think a doll in this color would look really awesome. I'm not a fan of the fish but the color salmon would look really nice. I do get poppy vibes from it and it kind of reminds me of Georgia as well because we know Georgia's color is peach but I think salmon would make a good addition to the orange fam. If you wanted a bit more orange than salmon, you can go for mango. I thought this was really nice too. Again, Poppy vibes, but Poppy had a couple different shades of orange. So I think that's okay if they were to, you know, reuse some of those shades in a doll that is completely orange. Now, this kind of might be very close to Mina's color, but I'm not quite sure. So I put it in here anyway. So this one is watermelon. And while I was looking at this one, I don't particularly like the color, but I think it might be a unique concept and then I just got this really like crazy cliche idea what if they did an entire series based off of like fruit colors so then you'd have like this watermelon for like pink or whatever obviously you'd have like tangerine lemon possibly banana you know I saw like grape purple you know that would be freaking hilarious and I think that would just that'd be a great series five you know just putting that out there we're ending with a pink one and no I did not intentionally stick with the fruit theme here this is wild strawberry and I think yes it is a lot closer to Stella's color than I would like but I think it's really cool and I thought its name was really great so this this would make a good addition to the pink family obviously even though we don't need more pink dolls like realistically but do I want more pink dolls absolutely there are just a few colors that I think would make really nice additions to the Rainbow High color family. I've also thought about doing this with Shadow High because in doing this, I realized there's a lot more shades of black, white, and gray than what I initially realized. So if you would like to see a Shadow High version of this, let me know down below. Also, I have been toying with the idea of kind of making my own Rainbow High Series 5, like just theoretically, okay? Because if you don't know, I am a creative writer um, by, like, it's my hobby besides this. So I am constantly coming up with new characters and plot lines and things like that. So I think it would be really nice for me to just pick six core colors and then develop characters off of that. I could pick their focus and their personality and their fashion style. So let me know if you'd be interested in that. I think I would have to, you know, really like sit down and do some serious brainstorming because... I don't know you have to when you make a character you have to make them unique so let me know if you would like to see me do that because i think that might be a really cool concept as well so also another thing i want you guys to let me know down in the comments what are some colors you would like to see brought to the rainbow high franchise thank you all so much for joining me if you have not already give this video a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button to join the fam and tap that really cool notification bell so you can know the exact moment i post a new video have a blessed day and i'll talk to you all soon bye everybody